up, SK Lifestylers? I don't know if we have a good old-fashioned gunfight today, but we definitely have a pretty cool toy. So with that said, let's start unboxing. Alright. Grab a pair of trusty scissors in case I need them. Let's see what this daisy is all about. So, little backstory. Um, they actually had this on a wicked sale at Cabela's. So, I got myself one and I actually got my best friend one. Shout out, A. And I know he already took his out and was shooting with it the other day and letting his daughter try it out. So, we're definitely going to have a shoot off, me and him for sure. As soon as it gets warmer, uh, me and him will definitely have a little competition and I'll definitely post that up. Open this and up, opening this up backwards, but whatever. However, we get it done, right? So, nothing too special. It's pretty much just your basic BB gun, a little bit of sights up top. Uh, CO2 cartridge goes down here. Wind, uh, you know, you wind it up to tighten it up and uh, open the uh, airway. And that's about it. I'm pretty sure I fill the BBs. Uh, Looks like I fill them down here. I have absolutely no idea. So, oh, okay. So you pull those back and then you can pour them in through there. So I'm going through this just uh, same time as you guys. I didn't open this up earlier. Obviously, I just popped the, uh, the zip ties open. I mean, to me, this is pretty cool. You know what I mean? Again, it's just a little toy to have around the house. I used to have a couple BB guns when I was a kid. And, uh, you know, I just figured, hey, for, you know, 20, 30 bucks, why not? Um, I got one of those BB gun pistols, so I already had some BBs, as you see there, with the CO2 cartridges. So uh, this is not just going to be an unboxing. We are definitely going to go outside and shoot a couple bottles and cans. But I'll give you one more quick close-up. And I'll say this thing weighs maybe about 5 pounds, 4 to 5 pounds. Uh, it's, it's really not bad. Definitely could be used by any any small kid or adult for sure. Uh, I think any any kid over the age of like six is definitely capable of shooting this with no problem. Uh, this is supposed to shoot, I think, like 350 feet a second. And 350 feet a second. Max shooting distance, 210 yards. Uh, 15 shot magazine. Oh, man. 200 round reservoir let me uh just load this thing up and then we can get outside and rip off a few shots what do you say yeah sk lifestyle thanks for watching hey and be sure to subscribe because why not and hit the like and share all right so let's load the bbs that's good Now loading up the magazine, what we do is take this, push it all the way over and push it down. And then I think we just shake this around. All right, you shake it around a bit, I don't know. And then <laughs> you get some in there and then you're good to go. All right, so I'm gonna do this one-handed. So I'm gonna unscrew this a bit, flip open this tab here. Pop that off. Drop our CO2 in the bank here. Oh, I'm gonna push this down a little more. There we go. Pop this little plate back on. Again, it will be a lot easier if you don't do it with uh, just one hand. And then just squeeze this back in. should be good to go so let me go set up some targets and uh, then we can go shoot
think I'm gonna go fill him up with water, make it a little more interesting. All right, I got my enemy all lined up, ready to get shot up. So let's go set him up and knock him down. You already know. <laughs> I think that should be good for my uh, first setup for target practice. What do you guys think? Let's go uh, scout out where I'm gonna set up and uh, let's go shoot some stuff, yeah. All right, so it's kind of cold out here, but we'll see how well I do. All right, so they're definitely fun little toys. Uh, I would definitely say that this rifle is plenty decent for any little junior or even adult. It was still fun to plink around with. It's definitely not strong enough to cause any kind of serious catastrophe. I mean, obviously you could shoot somebody in the eye, you know, the old Christmas story tale, whatever. But um, I, I mean, it's not penetrating through those bottles with water in it, which I kind of thought it would. Um, but hey, it was still a cool little toy. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this review. Let me know if you have any uh, questions or comments. Leave those down below. And as always, like, share, and subscribe to SK Lifestyle. With that said, I'll see you guys next time.